Okay, so here's the needle cutter I'm dealing with. It's working, but it, it can be better still, and I'm still getting feedback on how to improve it. I'm not convinced that for the size wire I'm using, which is, uh, let me double check here, this is, no, not that one, this one over here is the, uh, what is this here? Come on. This is the .025 music wire, and that's what's on here right now. But, as it moves here, watch and you'll notice how much it shifts from side to side in that guide. And I think that's why I'm getting such a ragged cut with it, because of all that shifting going on. If you look up here as it goes, you can really see it swing as the crank pulls it from one side to another. Let me zoom out a little bit here, the old foot zoom. And you'll notice every time it goes up one side and down the other that it just swings in there big time. So I've been looking at going back to using one of these uh, welding tips with the wire and possibly going to the really thin 015 wire. Right here is the, yeah, the 015. That's so thin. I'm I'm not convinced that that's going to do a good job, but at least one person's using it and it seems to work well. But here's the 025, which is the suggested wire to start with. And I don't know if I can hold my camera and demonstrate this, but I have here what I'm using currently as my tip, which is one of these inflation needles. And if I put the inflation needle on here, which is kind of tricky to do one-handed. I should have brought out my tripod. But it it's really wobbly on there. It can really shift around. And if I can hold this phone in place here. If I, I mimic the movement, you can really see as I pull this wire up and down, so it's really moving in there. Compared to, if I take one of the, uh, make sure I got the right one, huh? The 035. No, that's no two. Yeah, that's th the 35 welding tip. Now, if I put it in the welding tip, and I do that same movement. I don't get nearly, you see that? It doesn't move nearly as much. So I think the welding tip is going to constrain it better. Now with this 025 wire, I also have some 01, in the, in this pack of tips gives me a uh, 0 .03, 0 .025, which definitely won't work with this wire, and the 035. So I may experiment. I may go back to experimenting here. This is the 3.0. So that would constrain it even better because that's you know, only giving me like five thousandths of clearance. And it, it feels nice and loose in there. And if I move it up and down, this is more me letting the tip move in my fingers than the wire moving in there. You can see on the right side it's really moving. On the left it's barely moving at all. So I'm, I may go back and experiment with these welding tips. Try that. I've also been suggested that, back over here, um, at the top of my stroke, well, I guess maybe I am going all the way up. I, I thought I wasn't. No, it, it's, it's basically even with the end here. If I can focus, you see it's, uh, it's just barely, barely sticking out there. And I've been told having it actually disappear up in there might work better. But I think the big problem is it's not, you see how much that's moving? It's just not constrained enough with this. So I'm going to have to take this piece of wood off, make a new one, and try the other size hole on it to see how that goes. So 
it's getting there. The machine's doing pretty well. I still need to expand it out to fill the whole table that I built. I don't know if I can get the table in the video here. I'll try. But there's the table I built. And the machine will pretty much fill that table when I'm done with it. I ran out of wood for the leg braces. Need to finish that up. But it's, it's nice and stable. I'd use this as a workbench already. And I'll be getting the computer set up out here in a day or two. I could just drag out my notebook, but for now, we'll make do. So, progress is happening. I'm just not making it fast, and I'm not in a rush. Taking my time. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get some nicer, cleaner cuts soon. Because I'm not that disappointed with the cuts I'm getting. But, I know they could be better. So, I'm going to keep striving for it. Alright. Have fun.